We are especially pleased to be hosting you on this beautiful day at Tanchich Mihai compound, which currently serves as home to the Embassy's Marine Security Guard Detachment. I want to thank the Marines and the entire Embassy staff for their hard work in preparing for this celebration. And I want to ensure everyone here that we are continuing to work hard to return this historic and beautiful property back to the people of Hungary. Hungarians and Americans have shared more than two centuries of friendship and that shared history and cooperation continues today with American and Hungarian soldiers serving together in Afghanistan. Hungary is an important NATO ally and will soon lead the European Union. We are proud to call Hungary an ally, a partner, and a friend. The economic success of both our nations is also an important part of our relationship. Even in this tumultuous financial environment, Hungary continues to attract U.S. investment with its open economy, talented, hardworking people, its fabulous infrastructure, and of course, its spectacular beauty. Let me also take a moment to personally thank all of the American companies who generously, generously sponsored today's event. It is a special privilege for us to welcome Prime Minister Orban as our guest of honor today. <laughs> President Obama pledged in his congratulatory letter to you, Mr. Prime Minister, that we will, quote, continue to build on our solid and long-standing foundation of shared values and aspirations. I am so proud to be here today representing President Obama, Secretary Clinton, and all my fellow Americans to fulfill this pledge. Thank you very much. <laughs>